dear learners myself mr s k patil department of pharmacology kisan vidya prasarak sanstha mh college of pharmacy boradi now today we'll discuss on the top first topic of pharmacology syllabus according to pci and education regulation 1991 introduction to basic pharmacology and its scope okay so contents of today's presentations or discussion it includes the definition of pharmacology meaning of drugs various sources of drugs scope of pharmacology different branches of pharmacology and lastly theoretical index so first of all pharmacology so pharmacology term pharmacology is derived from the two main greek words pharmakon that means the drugs and logos means the science or to study okay that means pharmacology is nothing but the all about the study of drug drug effect on your body and body shows the response for the drugs okay it means the knowledge of history sources physical and chemical property of drugs absorption distribution metabolism and excretion of the drugs and therapeutic effects and uses of the drugs pharmacology manje kay all about the study of drugs manje that means it includes the detailed information regarding to the drugs okay when the any substance or any molecules or medicines that interact with your living systems through the chemical processes एक तुमचा एखादा सबस्टन्स एखादा तुमच्या बॉडीच्या लिव्हिंग सिस्टीम सोबत इंटरॅक्ट होत असेल कशासाठी टू मेंटेन द फिजिओलॉजी ऑफ युअर बॉडी टू मेंटेन द फिजिओलॉजी ऑफ युअर बॉडी म्हणजे इम्बॅलन्स इन बिटवीन युअर फिजिओलॉजी ॲट अ टाइम्स यू टेक अ मेडिसिन्स जेव्हा तुमची फिजिओलॉजीमध्ये चेंजेस असेल फ्युअर होत असेल किंवा एखाद चिल्स असेल स्निजिंग असेल कफिंग असेल किंवा कुठल्या तरी डिसऑर्डर तुम्हाला बॉडीवर झाला असेल ॲट द टाइम्स यू टेक अ मेडिसिन्स ऑर ड्रग सबस्टन्स कशासाठी ड्रग सबस्टन्स घेतो टू मेंटेन द फिजिओलॉजी नॉर्मल फिजिओलॉजी ऑफ युअर बॉडी ओके सो बाय मीन्स ऑफ दिस ड्रग्स दे शोज द फार्मोकोलॉजिकल और डिझायर और अनडिझायर इफेक्ट ऑन युअर बॉडी सो ड्रग दॅट मीन्स द द मिनिंग ऑफ ड्रग्स ड्रग्स अकॉर्डिंग टू द डब्ल्यू एच ओ वर्ल्ड हेल्थ ऑर्गनायझेशन्स द डिफिनेशन ऑफ ड्रग्स drug is the any substances or products that intended or to be used to cure or prevention or treatment of the disease or disorder to the human beings and animals that means the any substances that administer for internally or externally for the diagnosis prevention cure treatment and treatment of the disease or disorder to the human beings and animals so the drug molecules they interact with your living systems and shows the desire or undesirable effects okay so how they get show effect on your body they binding with the receptors after the administer after the absorption they bind with the receptors uh, and shows the pharmacological effect when the drugs are bind with the receptors only at the times they shows the effect otherwise the drugs are not able to show the effects okay it's depend on the drug affinity and drug efficacy so drug affinity that means the tendency of drugs that shows the the bind with the receptors that means the the tendency or ability of drug get bind with the receptors and drug affinity efficacy that means the the ability of drugs that shows the effect of dr- on your body okay so next one is the pharmacokinetics so these are the main two branches of pharmacology pharmacokinetics and pharmacodynamics that means the pharmacokinetics from the word indicate pharmacokinetics that means the movement of drugs pharma that means the drugs and kinetic that means the movement so the movement of the drugs the so one compartment to the another compartment one place to the another place that means the is all about the movement of drugs so what the body does to the drugs tumche body e drug sobat kay karte okay after the administration of drug what the body does to the drugs body e drug la kay karun dete so it deals with the study of absorption distribution by transformation and excretion of drugs so absorption first step of the pharmacokinetic that means the absorption so absorption this is the movement of drug molecule from the site of administration into the 
सर्क्युलेशन जेव्हा तुमचा ड्रग ॲडमिनिस्टर केला बाय एनी रूट्स ओरल रूट्स और इंटरल रूट्स और पैरेंटल रूट्स और ट्रॉपिकल रूट्स ओके वेन द एडमिनिस्ट्रेशन ऑफ ड्रग्स एट द टाइम्स ऑफ और द फ्रॉम द साइट ऑफ एडमिनिस्ट्रेशन टू द सस्टू अप टू द सिस्टमिक सर्क्युलेशन सेकंड वन इज द डिस्ट्रीब्यूशन आफ्टर द एब्सॉर्शन ऑफ ड्रग्स ड्रग्स को डू द सिस्टमिक सर्क्युलेशन एंड इन दे डिस्ट्रीब्यूट इन टू द वेरियस बॉडी कंपार्टमेंट्स दे डिस्ट्रीब्यूट इन टू द वेरियस बॉडी कंपार्टमेंट इन द स्मॉल स्मॉल पोर्शन और स्मॉल स्मॉल concentration that means the movement of drug molecule from the circulation to the tissue and various different body parts okay that means the distributions okay at the times then next one is the biotransformation biotransformation is also called as the metabolisms and fate of the drugs that means biotransformation it includes the one chemical form change into the another chemical form that means the conversion of drug from one chemical structure or one chemical form into the another chemical forms that by the using of met enzymes or with the help of enzymes okay the lastly excretions excretion that means movement of drug molecules out of the body okay and la- next pharmacodynamics so pharmacodynamics is nothing but the what the drug does to the body drug body work kai effect show karto that means the pharmacodynamics okay so it includes the biochemical reaction of the drugs physiochemical effect of the drugs mechanism of action of the drugs mm, all all the effects and actions shows by the drugs this study is called as the pharmacodynamic study so the some questions are arises in your mind so ask yourself why you are you why you are taking the medicines why you are taking the medicines and what happen after the administration of drugs or what happen when you take the medicines jo tumi medicine ka geta आणि मेडिसिन घेतल्यानंतर तुम्हाला कुठल्या प्रकारचं इफेक्ट किंवा मेडिसिन घेतल्यानंतर तुमच्या बॉडीमध्ये काय चेंजेस होतात सो वेन द ॲडमिनिस्ट्रेशन ऑफ ड्रग्स फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल वाय यू टेक द मेडिसिन्स तुम्ही मेडिसिन का घेता तर मेडिसिन आपण का घेतो जो एनी चेंजेस और एनी फिजॉलॉजिकल चेंजेस इन द बॉडी काहीतरी फिजॉलॉजिकल चेंजेस बॉडीमध्ये झाले असतील डिसीज और डिसऑर्डर झाले असतील ते क्युअर करण्यासाठी किंवा ते प्रिव्हेंट करण्यासाठी डायग्नोस करण्यासाठी ट्रीटमेंट करण्यासाठी आपण काय करतो मेडिसिनल सबस्टन्स हे घेत राहतो ओके किंवा घेतो त्याच्यानंतर मग मेडिसिन सबस्टन्स घेतल्यानंतर आपल्याला जो डिझायर फार्मोकोलॉजिकल जे एक्सपेक्टेड फार्मोकोलॉजिकल इफेक्ट असेल तो एक्सपेक्टेड फार्मोकोलॉजिकल इफेक्ट आपल्याला तो बॉडीवर शो होतो किंवा इन सम केसेस और इन सम टाइम्स दे शोज द अनडिझायरेबल फार्मोकोलॉजिकल ॲक्शन्स किंवा काही अशा वेळेस तो एखाद वेळेस अनडिझायरेबल जे आपल्याला नको असे असे इफेक्ट बॉडीवर शो होता किंवा साईड इफेक्ट्स ॲडवर्स इफेक्ट लॉजिक इफेक्ट्स और अन इंटेंडेड इफेक्ट्स इज शो ऑन युअर बॉडी ओके नेक्स्टली दे शोज द ड्रग इफेक्ट डिझायरेबल इफेक्ट अँड अनडिझायरेबल इफेक्ट सो डिझायरेबल इफेक्ट दॅट मीन्स द एक्सपेक्टेड फार्मोकोलॉजिकल इफेक्ट्स इट इज ऑल्सो कॉल एज द एक्सपेक्टेड फार्मोकोलॉजिकल इफेक्ट वेन यू टेक द ड्रग्स और इवन यू ॲडमिनिस्टर द ड्रग्स फॉर द डायग्नोसिस पर्पज वेरियस टेस्ट Hmm? you don't for the various tests for the diagnosis of disease or disorder in your body then next prevention of drugs various vaccines are available to prevent the drugs uh, to prevent the disease or disorder to the body and treatment given to treat the disease or disorders these are the desirable effect that means the expected pharmacological effects and undesirable that means the some side effects adverse effects and toxic effects are produced by the drugs okay नेक्स्ट वन इज द सोर्सेस ऑफ ड्रग्स सोर्सेस ऑफ ड्रग्स दैट मीन्स द ड्रग्स आर ऑप्टेन फ्रॉम द वेरियस सोर्सेस और द ड्रग आर कुटून कुटून ऑप्टेन किया जो ओके सो नैचुरल सोर्सेस इट इन्क्लूड नैचुरल सोर्सेस एंड सिंथेटिक सोर्सेस नैचुरल सोर्सेस दैट मीन्स द प्लैंट और वेजिटेबल सोर्सेस देन एनिमल सोर्सेस माइक्रो सोर्सेस देन मिनरल सोर्सेस दीज आर द वेरियस नैचुरल सोर्सेस आर अवेलेबल आर द obtain the drug from their sources in that first natural sources plant sources okay or it is also called as the vegetable sources include it include the alkaloids which are the alkaloids that means you already know about the alkaloids alkaloids are the nit- nitrogenous organic compounds or they are the alkali substances or the they are the alkali compounds okay they shows the physiological actions when administer into the body for example it include morphine cocaine atropines quinines they are the various alkaloids are obtained from the 
plant sources okay then next one is the microbes okay microbe that means that these are the drugs which are obtained from the anim these are obtained from the microbes or the anti microorganisms they are obtained from the microorganisms for example antibiotics some are antibiotics or species of antibiotics which are isolated from the microorganism such as penicillin streptomycin or the various species of the ant antibiotics they are obtained from the various species of microorganisms to, to, to treat the microbial infections to treat the microbial infections okay next one is the animal sources or animal tissues the most of important hormones used in your body for example insulin are used in a treatment of diabetes mellitus in case of deficiency of insulin secretion in our body by the pancreas so at the times the replacements therapy that means the insulin are obtained from the animals and they inject into the body to maintain the insulin level in your body next example growth hormones thyroid hormones so these are the various animal secreted or animal sources drugs which are used to treat the disorders or disease in your body the next minerals it includes the few synthetic few therapeutic agents okay it includes the ions used for the treatment of anemia zinc used for the treatment of wounds iodine is used as an antiseptics they also used in a goit a goiter then lithium compounds is used for to treat the bipolar mental illness these are the all are the natural sources of drugs then second synthetic sources of drugs or artificial sources of drugs okay so synthesize the new compounds include aspirins barbiturates or chemical compounds or local anesthetics these are the all are the synthesize synthesize or the chemical compounds hmm? they are synthesized in a laboratories they are synthesized in a laboratories okay so modified naturally occurring drugs it includes the semi synthetic derivatives of the natural occurring drugs for example cocaine morphines these are the semi synthetically obtained or modified drugs obtained by the semi synthetic derivatives okay or in some cases the new compound or new drug molecules are discovered by accidental by the accidental when drug molecule are used for the another purpose for example tumi ekada drug geta asel suppose tumi ekada drug administer kela asel to desired pharmacological action sathi pan अशा वेळेस काय होतं की एखाद्या वेळेस तो ड्रग्स काय करतो अनडिझायरल किंवा ॲक्सिडेंटल इफेक्ट शो करतो वेन युअर बॉडी फॉर द दे बाय ॲक्टिव्हिटी ऑर द स्क्रीनिंग ऑफ द ह्यूज नंबर ऑफ रिलेटेड मॉलिक्युल फॉर द स्पेसिफिक फॉर्मोकोलिकल ॲक्शन म्हणजे काय करतो ॲक्सिडेंटल इफेक्ट किंवा अन इंटेंडेड ऑर अनएक्टेड अन एक्सपेक्टेड इफेक्ट शो करतो त्याला म्हणता आलं दे आर ऑल्सो दे आर सिंथेटिकली source of the drugs next one is the various branches of the pharmacology it includes the therapeutics chemotherapy toxicology pharmacoepidemics pharmacoeconomics pharmacogenetics toxicology so first of all pharmaco first pharmaco therapeutics or the therapeutics the branch of pharmacology that deals with the arts and science of treatment of disease so that means the application of drug molecules for the pharmacological effects or the for the cure or the prevention of the disease is called as the therapeutics or the pharmacotherapeutics next one is the chemotherapy so in that chemical simply chemotherapy that means the, the use of chemical substances to treat the disease or disorder occur or the caused by the microorganism or neoplastic cells so the use of chemical agents simply the use of chemical substances or chemical agents to treat the microbial diseases okay that means the the chemical that kill the cells especially those microorganisms and neoplastic cells okay next one toxicology toxicology is that means the the branch of pharmacology is deals with the study of poisonous effect or the adverse effect of the drugs on your body it deals with the symptoms mechanisms treatments and detection of poison is caused by the different chemical substances is called as the toxicology toxicology that means the simply the study of the effect of poisons okay next one is the clinical pharmacology so clinical pharmacology that means the is the scientific study of drugs in our mind 
or the volunteer human volunteers or in includes pharmacokinetics pharmacodynamics investigations in a healthy or the disease individuals it includes the comparisons with the placebo placebo that means the empty drugs hmm? so drugs that market also the comparisons of drugs hmm, into the market and surveillance programs it means the clinical pharmacology so in pharmaco economics that means the all about the study of cost of drugs that means the pharmaco economics in discipline with the cost of one drugs is compared with the another for the same purpose or the forms the same uses so cheapest drug are a uh, papers okay next one is the pharmaco genetics the branch of pharmacology deals with the genetic variations or the genetic information or genetic study is used to cause or the difference in the response of response among the individual or the populations that means the the genetic informations is used to treat the disease or used to treat the infections so pharmaco eco pharmaco genomics so pharmaco genomics that means the is the broader application of the genomics technology to the new drug discovery for the new drug discovery of further characterization of the older drugs okay then so next pharmaco epidemiology pharmaco epidemiology so pharmaco epidemiology that means the, the deals with the effect of drugs on the large populations that means the effect may be the good or harmful it may the effect may be a good or harmful so the that means the pharmaco epidemiology that means the the study of effect of drugs on the large populations okay lastly therapeutic index so therapeutic index that means the the ratio of the comparisons or the compare the blur concentration at which the drug becomes a toxic or harmful or toxic or harmful to the body that means the the safety margin of the drugs safety or the margin of safety of drugs okay that means the larger of therapeutic index the drug having the larger therapeutic index is the safer of use of drugs for or the drug has the smaller therapeutic index the drug must be a close or the doses carefully so the person receiving the drugs should be a monitors closely okay so because at the times the large uh, smaller the therapeutic index the drugs chances to show the toxic effects okay so next the therapeutic index that means measurement of the drug safety the measurement of the drug safety it refers to the relationship between the toxicity of drugs and therapeutic effects okay so formula of the therapeutic index is therapeutic index is equal to the toxic dose or td50 upon ed50 ed50 that means the effective dose and toxic dose okay so therapeutic index of the drugs is the ratio of the dose of that products toxicity to the dose of that products or produces a clinically desired or effective response okay so td50 that means the dose of drugs that causes the toxic response in 50% of a populations and ed50 that means the the therapeutic effects in the 50% of populations so it is a ratio between the ed50 and ld50 okay or the td50 or ed50 so a safer dose or safer drugs has been a higher therapeutic index when the it the drug having the higher therapeutic index it's a safer to be used on when the drugs are the lower therapeutic index is the closely monitoring the drugs hmm? closely monitoring the patients or the drugs or the populations or chances of toxicity is more so more the dangerous the drugs has been lower therapeutic index may require the regular monitoring of the drug levels for example in that warfarin lithiums or digoxins these are the lower therapeutic index drugs at the times in case of warfarin the treatment of or therapy of drugs with the warfarin lithium or digoxins the more the monitoring is required hmm, for the drug levels okay thank you hmm. it's all about the study of pharmacology or basic pharmacology